how are we doing do we have a good weekend welcome welcome this is a little beep with me welcome if you are new to the show please say hello even on the replay i always love knowing where you are coming in from how you found me what you like to play with because this show is made for you and so um it's been a, uh, a great weekend for me. I had a nice little anniversary celebration. Um, so this is uh, really getting over Friday Night Live. Did you guys uh, catch that last uh, Friday? We were playing with Lucite and um, had a little hiccup and so I wanted to play with it a little bit here today. So that's what I'm gonna have on my table here today. But as we get uh, some people popping on, notifications going on. Are you guys getting your notifications? I I never know. Um, you know, because, like, these things have been weird. I don't get comments. Like, right now, um, I was I was seeing if I could see any, any comments. How good it looks, how clear it looks. Uh, make sure you say hello. Why... I can't see any comments. That's like so annoying. Get to be alone today? That always is a bummer. <laughs> Sound on, check, check, one, two, three. And I don't know, welcome to Be With Me. I'm Kay, your host from Fantastic Stars Beads. Do I get to do it all over again? Are people even on? You got a notification? All right, I'm having to like look at a different screen. I see hearts and thumbs up, so I know people are there. All right, so um, so it's been an eventful week. Thank you for all the uh, anniversary wishes. Um, I had a nice weekend with the hubby, a little bit slower since he's a little bit... Um, obviously still still dealing with a hernia and so trying to keep him slowed down um but he's hanging in there and uh we have at least an appointment to go get a consultation for when his surgery will be and i feel like that's like taking forever it's like holding the breath uh but um i i um I'm doing a little extra to keep him comfortable. And so, um, so it's time for a beating break. <laughs> uh, I know that. So that's what we do here on Beat With Me. If you guys are new, uh, I'm going to be playing with Lucite here today because I didn't get enough chance to play with it last week. So if you guys are caught Friday Night Live, uh, I'll be extending that, um, that sale. Uh, right now I'm kind of in limbo holding on whether I'm going to run a uh, Friday Night Live uh, this coming Friday um, with impending things going on. And so um, I will post some things if I, um, you know, think I can do that instead. I think I'm going to extend last Friday Night Live uh, because we're going to still be playing with Lucite. And I, I hate for you guys to miss out if you're like, oh my gosh, I didn't know you could do that with Lucite. Then, you know, you might want to get your chance at some. Okay. So um, I hope that sounds okay since I can't see or um, <gasps> look, I see a comment. Hey, Barbara. All right, I'm going to say my hellos uh, really quick. I think I saw Janelda on there and Susan and Caroline. And um, so, Caroline, I'm seeing that you said that uh, you missed Friday Night Live. Well, I don't know if you just heard. I just extended it. <laughs> I just extended it because, you know, um, hubby has a hernia. What? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I don't want to uh, overpromise things, and uh, y you know, so that's why I may be um, holding out on another Friday Night Live because you know what I'm supposed to be doing, which I still might. Okay, so let me l let me announce also that I I might try to travel. A tr I wanted to do a um, a trip to a warehouse and. Uh, and see a stash but 
things are, you know, holding me back, but I, I, I still might just take off <laughs> and do it just for a couple days before, you know, depending on when we can get in to see, um, a doctor. So, um, you're going to be hearing more in the next couple days. You never know. I, I don't slow down. Um, so I, you know, the hunt for beads is always, always on. And so, uh, I hate to hold up, uh, that particular part of the show. That way then, uh, I can get back while we're, you know, um, after surgery. <laughs> so I can be home. Um, but that's kind of the way things are balancing out right now. I'm all finally getting to see comments. Hey, Donna. And Marty and Robin. Where are you coming in from, Robin? You look new. All right. So let's play a little bit. Okay. Enough talk. I know, um, you know, life happens, and so you gotta just like take it a day at a time, and that's why um, we're taking a beating break right now. You know, the house is quiet right now, and um, and I'm excited <laughs> to show you a little fun with Lucite. Um, I was playing around with these things, and I saw that there was like um, a whole bunch of uh, clear ones, and sometimes you don't get the color that you want. And so um, I was doing a lot of actually uh, spray painting furniture with a neighbor friend, and so that got me um, kind of thinking about coloring uh, Lucite. And so, Let's take a look at what's on case table today and um, let's check it out, okay? So, oh, Karen, you get to come check me out live. Awesome. Ooh, Louisville, Kentucky. That's cool. All right, so for those that might have missed last week, don't worry. We're going to kind of like, you know, have a Groundhog's Week <laughs> and uh, do it again um, just because I didn't get a chance to play as much. And I really like to show you kind of the different things you can do with uh, this particular product line. And uh, wow, and it's and it's vintage. So there was limited uh, of what I have and what I felt was quite unusual. You know, normally you see a lot of those little flowers and bell flowers, but you're always missing the leaves right so there were some flowers too but there were some awesome like petals and and leaves and everything and so um we had some awesome color already you know and but but maybe you're not like into mermaids and uh you know fantasy uh colors like i am but i don't know who you could be because you know you you <laughs> you're watching this show so I you know like I know you guys are all purple purple and teal lovers right I mean but anyway if you don't get the colors that you want um I pulled out some of the alcohol inks and uh I want to play with those a little bit and show you a little bit of fun and where it's fairly not not too messy <laughs> Okay, you know, because as, as for anybody who has worked with this alcohol ink, it's, it's, it's staining. <clears throat> um, so I, I couldn't find my gloves, but I found that this wasn't too bad. And um, what you want, though, is uh, I'm doing this on some wax paper. Um, so the supplies that you need are some clean paper towels some alcohol inks, you can, you know, use different kinds. I've got some tiny plastic bags and uh, whatever lucite that you might have. So maybe you cut off from a necklace. Like I I had these uh, lucites and you know, they're not like exactly exciting, <laughs> right? Like that's not gonna be necessarily my first choice, right? Like I'm gonna go after these, but I love the fact that they're like big beads, right? So, um, so let's uh, see what we can do to change it up and and play around. All right, does that sound good? This is this is gonna be fun. All right, so I've I've pulled out just three colors to mess with today. I figured that's that's enough to kind of show you the idea, and you can certainly mess around on your own. Um, so the first thing we're gonna do is like pick out. Do you guys want to do like a frosted or a clear? Cause like sometimes maybe like the the beads are trying to match or you know just trying to make something different. What do you guys What do you guys think I should do? Maybe some we're, we'll do a few of these, but let let's try like a um. Do you want to do a bead frosted first? Maybe we'll try one of these leaves. No, I really like these 
I want to see what this clear flower <laughs> flower is going to look like. Does that sound good? All right. <clears throat> What's the first color you guys want to do? All right, I've got three choices. I always like your guys' opinion. All right, do we want to do sapphire blue first? I've got this uh, peach red, which is kind of like a fuchsia E, and a cerulean which is my teal. Okay, so what do we think? What, what, what should we do first? This is uh, fun to see right before your eyes. All right, and I'll take a vote on if you want to do what else you want to do. Okay, we had a vote. Amanda likes a bead. We're definitely going to do a bead too. All right, I got some red. I got some teal. I got some blue. What color uh, ladies do we have out there now? Of course, you can use any color. I, I just, uh, I'm, I'm picking some of my favorite because, you know, because I can, right? Who's out there? Teal, teal, blue, red, peach red, teal, teal, heavy on the teal. <laughs> Let me go. We're going to play around. Okay, so, and Amanda wanted a bead, so should we do a teal, teal bead? All right. Now, uh, alcohol ink is uh, a little bit more liquid, so this is going to be more like a stain versus a paint. Janelda is asking, what's the difference between ink and paint, like the new Ultimate? So, um, this is going to soak in versus paint is going to sit on top. Okay. All right. Ready? Take that plastic bag. All right. I'm going to get my paper towel close. We're going to do a bead. Amanda wants a bead. Who knows, Amanda, maybe I'll throw this bead in your, in your stash. All right. Let's put it. Now I found this was like, um, a better way to kind of save on your, on your ink because you could certainly, you know, paint it, but I'm going to show you in a plastic bag that we're going to, um, and you can reuse these to keep the same color. <laughs> you want this bead, Amanda? There you are. Glad you can be with us. Hey, Phyllis. Glad you could pop on. How you doing today? All right, let's let's see what your teal bead's gonna look like, Amanda. <laughs> Let it dry off. All right, let's pop it out. All right, like, oh, look how amazing that looks. All right, so I'm gonna kind of do a little dab to get some of the excess, cause it always like I feel like collects at the hole. Right now it's like, now who wants that bead? <laughs> right? Am I right? Like going from like this to that. I mean, like in an instant. All right. That was an awesome choice. How long is dry time, Janelda? Um, it's not bad. Like it's almost dry now. You know, but I would like to spray a sealer on it. Still, you know, to be honest, just feel feel like it at all. But it's 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 more like a stain. But it, it it's just like kind of feeling like furniture, kind of encase it. But isn't that awesome? All right, let's do a different something else. Let's do this clear flower. All right, let's do this clear flower in. All right, so that one we just did this blue. Okay, so we'll kind of like show you here. Okay, now we've got, all right, the other choice seemed, well, let's try, let's try this. Hmm. I think the other choice, I don't want to um, get too much on my hands. All right, now I think there was more choice on red next, this peach red. So... <clears throat> Let's try that again. Look at that. <clears throat> that wasn't quite the red I was thinking when I was going to pop it, pop 
pop that out there, but you know, I like it. All right, it looks kind of a hot, bloody mess. <laughs> it would, I would uh, imagine that it would make it a little bit glossy. Uh, Robin's asking if the sealer, but you know, there's kind of a matted sealer too. But you know, um, I found like, you know, that's why we want, this is like a messing around Monday here today. So here you can see, taking it out of the bag, I'm rubbing it on my hand and not, not getting, not getting much. Oh, where, what happened to my flower? Okay, you guys ready? Let's see what this magic's gonna look like. Hey, Barb. Oh, I'm sending prayers to you, Barb. Need a beating break? We're like getting messy. All right, see that pink? Maybe, can you see that pink? It's like hot. All right, I'm gonna kind of dab it out because it's a little, it's a little loud, you know. <laughs> I can, uh, but it kind of sits in the crevices and glows. All right. I'm dabbing that out. We're going to set that there. Now that's pretty though. So that's kind of the translucent. We did this here. So that's like from this icy. All right. And then this was a more matted. So kind of these frosted things here. Okay. Let, let's, let's do a blue since we haven't. Shall we? Let's do now. Um, let's do like a. You guys want to see what it'll look like in 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 a clear? What that blue will look like? Let's try it. <clears throat> We're playing around with color, and I love that this is you know messy, but not too messy. <laughs> um. So we're because remember when we did that enameling and I put uh, you know the the plastic wrap you know th this is a little bit nice nicer and contained way to do it too. All right, let's see what this blue is. like all right those are the and I like kind of seeing the translucent but we can, can kind of see I'm just dabbing dabbing it you can certainly do it again There's a, a translucent blue. I really like this uh, big leaf. And so, uh, So we did a frosted. Let's see a frosted in this color. And hey Paula, glad you could pop on. All right, so like I said, you can just keep it in the same bag. Now let's uh Now let's get my favorite color. Shall we? Let's see. 
Now I'm putting a little bit of the cerulean in there. And we're going to see what color comes out, you guys. Uh, what do you guys think of what's happening? Alright, what do you think it's gonna, gonna look like? Beautiful? Alright. Dun 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 dun! <laughs> Then you can start getting crazy and start mixing stuff. Look how awesome that looks. Now, <clears throat> that is a pretty sweet deal right there. Now, I want to try, maybe let's try... Mm, let's try putting this pink one into, which should I put it into blue or teal? You know, I want to put it into teal, but maybe I'll try, we'll put it into here, or should I put it in the back into purple? This <laughs> is like, I don't know. See what happens. And I feel like it's awesome because you can kind of like reuse the ink because it is... I know, of course we wanted to put it into teal. Here, we'll put this one into teal. Because <laughs> we know what it looks like. Now let's mix some color, shall we? There's all my teal girls, though. All right, we're doing both. Ba-doop, ba-doop, ba-doop. <laughs> we're making some magic today. We're, we're going to just see what happens. With just three colors, you know? It's kind of neat. Alright. I'm loving that. Just going to see more color there here in a second. Messing around. Ooh, look at that. That turned out. I'm liking that. All right, let's 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 dump this baby out. I didn't put any more teal in there. I probably could have because I don't see as much on there, but that's okay too. You know, maybe I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put it in here. <laughs> it looks like a. It looks like there's enough ink in there to do something. Let's just see what that looks like. I guess that it might be closer to this, huh? Maybe I want more. Yeah. Then we'll throw this one back in here. How about that? <laughs> you guys are funny. We're just uh, messing around here. Like I said, I haven't added anything, but maybe like, oh, see how it like changes? can do a couple layerings here, see, until you like it. And you know how that goes. Making two of them, you better go doing them at the same time, I suppose. You could do a larger bag. I was just doing these little ones. You know. So. Let's do. <laughs> I just like, I like, of course I like more teal. I want that big teal leaf. Right? Who doesn't want a big teal leaf? Oh, I'll drop these in your guys' bags, huh? Sure. 
make more samples, you know, right? Make more samples so you can. Now let's see if we like, um, all right, so that was messing around with some clear. Oh my God, I got it all over. <laughs> Trying to stay clean, but you know. Now I wanna try, let's try um, something that already had a color. Like these ones had a color, you know? I'm gonna do it in something like teal and just see what it is. Now, if you guys want the alcohol inks, I put in the um, link to the Amazon shop. You can look under, I think I put it under like resin and stuff. Maybe the alcohol inks because, you know, I like to play with it with resin. And you know I like to make everything teal <laughs> or purple. All right. Let's see what happened here. You know, you can certainly just do it until you're, you know, satisfied. Now this was the teal that came with, uh, that was in the set. So we can kind of see the color difference here. So from that bead, different color blue. So I took my rings off for this, uh, for this demonstration. I was not taking chances. I would recommend you do the same. But those are looking gorgeous. Neato. I just like uh, kind of mixing them. Because you know I want to put this, this purple one and this teal one. Yes, my uh, Donna is asking. Yes, my mom is settling in. Thanks for asking. She's coming along nicely. I'm, uh... She's, certain things are not fitting, so I'm trying to help her get rid of some things. And, all right, so this was the peach one. You can see that it was uh, versus this one. So we can kind of see the color difference that came out. So th this was the difference here. So we just took this one and put it in teal. So that's what a colored one did versus this one started like that and made this color. But here you can really see the, but I really like the mixing, seeing how that comes out. Let's see how, sometimes you don't want a lot anyway, so can just see what's left in the bag. Ooh, look at that. It's not, now it's not all purple. Ooh, look how yummy that is. Ooh, how fun is that now? All right. Oh, you know what? I wanted to try these uh, lime, lime leaves here. Let's see. All right. So maybe I'm going to stick one. I'm going to stick one in different bags. So these, you can see this. Let's leave one out. And then we'll put. Let's put one in every bag and just see what the colors look like. When you kind of. You know. What do you think that's going to look like? Pushing it around. Trying to get 
feel like I need I might need a little more teal since we you know kind of use that one up. I'm gonna stick this light green one in there too. Let's see. There, right, we'll go back to this one. That one sit in there a little bit. All right, this one was in the pink or purple. Ooh, that kind of added like a deep, deep color tone. Kind of almost looks coppery. That's what that did. We're going to zoom in on that in a moment once my hands are not inked up. All right, so that was purple. Let me remember that. All right, ooh, this is the blue. We'll set that on top of the blue. That was nice. And this is the teal. Kind of see what that did. This is nice. You can kind of see what's gonna what it's gonna do without having to get dirty. All right, so here's the original. Okay, and and voila. All right, that's a little bit of playing today. I'm going to let me just dry off my hands before we touch anything else here. Now, we didn't get back to using fuchsia, but I had done, you know, some other fun fun samples here. Let's uh Get a little bit closer to what we did here today. And kind of see what you think. All right, you guys. You guys liked uh, messing around Monday here today. <laughs> Let's see those hearts, those thumbs up. It's always fun having a little beating break with you guys. Look how that turned out. That looks awesome. <laughs> All right, these are good. Kind of, I'm seeing them a little bit more up close. All right, Amanda, there's your bead. That bead looks awesome. And look at that pretty blue. Okay, so here's that. Okay, so here's the original green leaf. All right, this is when I dipped it into purple. Look how that looked. It made it almost look like a check glass flower. And that was putting it in purple. Okay, and then this one was putting it into, um, into the sapphire blue. And then this was putting it in the teal gave it a whole different hue. So see, they're kind of th three different greens, right? So if you're trying to do all different, you know, colors sometimes and you only have this color, no, you don't. No, you don't. <laughs> you got all these colors you can make, right? This is what that teal one did to that one. I didn't, uh, you can see it didn't, you know, fill it all in, but that's all right. It's not like terrible, right? So this, you know, kind of like a marble look, right? Okay. Super fun. I, I can't believe you go from like this right here to like that right there. Or this. Is that amazing? Pretty cool.
Uh, other than uh, getting that ink off, yep. A little bit of al alcohol, water, get that. But <laughs> I'll be dropping those uh, into your guys' stashes. So uh, thanks for joining me as always. Um, I always have a little bit of fun. We're going to see uh, what's in store for us uh, this week. We're going to kind of take it play by play. So um, if you're not part of the Star Special Stash group, that's oftentimes where I'm putting up those notices uh, first thing so you can get in the know, uh, as well as joining our community for uh, inspiration. You know, um, people are uh, are always asking questions, uh, showing showing what's on the wrist, what's on the workspace. And if you guys have some Lucite, if you guys uh, try some alcohol inks, like, we want to see it. That's uh, your chance to uh, share with us your bead life uh, if you guys have any questions. Um, so come on and join us. It's at, um, I, you know, it's, it's in the groups. There's a link right up top that you can uh, uh, grab. All right, that was fun. Now I've got to wash off those hands before I touch too much more. All right, have a good one. We're going to uh, pop on, uh, back on on Wednesday, okay? And it'll be a surprise. Who knows? you know, that's part of the show. So keep on watching you guys. Uh, have a fantastic rest of your day and uh, we'll play again on Wednesday. Okay. Emily, you want to see my pendant? This is that clay pendant. Do you remember? Um, all that polymer clay. You like that? Thanks, Janelda. We'll see you on Wednesday, Susan. Now, th those were all going out. I feel like I might have a few, few of these. So you can DM me if you're if you're interested to add some more to your stash. Just uh, getting through those all. So DM me, okay? I can send pictures. All right, you guys. Have a good rest of the day. Thanks.